previously on Fallout. He's dead. I'm trying to get an internship over the summer. Wasn't Max going for that too? If I'm gonna use information that I found, Stop. then I will. Apparently someone submitted a proposal that wasn't theirs. Gunderson had to go look through all the files and re-interview it. And it turns out that Vanessa has slept with 20 people within the last year. And your pills are just a temporary fix. Not a very good one. No one has to know, and nobody will know. We have an arrangement. You give me the pills, no questions asked, and I keep your part-time job a secret. Beth, you shouldn't be doing this. Shut the hell up, Vanessa. Just snort that and get the hell out. You know, Willie, if you really loved me, you wouldn't tell the cops up. That's true. Even if we weren't dating. Free Willie is back, Tim, with a thirstful, thirstful vengeance. I'd like to think we've started to get something good going here. You're still in love with me. You gotta get past her, just like I did with Max. You didn't get past me. Oh, it's a uh, video diary. It's new thing I'm trying. But the computer itself is yours. It is, okay? I can just start over again. With your in Houston? Yeah. I read your note you wrote Houston back. I know you two were trying to figure out who murdered Max, and since she left, it's just you. But I want to help. I want to help you solve Max's murder. Have you told him that you're transferring out of state next year? No, it's none of his business. I just need a fresh start. Did you find out anything interesting? Any new evidence? Nope, nothing big. We're gonna be together forever, Max. I love you. I know. I love this song, but I've always liked Pearl Jam. You know that, you know everything about me, Max. Sarah, I have to talk to you about... About how she's with me and not you? Don't ruin this for me, Max. Don't make things worse between us. Like, I have feelings for her. You know I do. I don't belong here. Why am I here? Vanessa, you're one of us. You belong here. No. I'm not wanted here. Why'd I even move in with you guys? Nobody likes me. And Max, I'm not exactly on stable ground. Zach, everything's gonna be okay. Yeah, we'll be okay if you give me your papers. I can't do this on my own. Tim, I need this internship just as much as you do. But you don't want it as much as I do. Tim, whatever you're thinking about doing, don't do it. But I have to. I need the money. Besides, who are you to tell everyone what to do? What you're doing is wrong. Beth, I care about you. you can't just... She's a big girl. She can do whatever the hell she wants. Why are you always protecting her? She's my everything. Well, maybe you should focus more on... On getting along with people more? Yeah, I know, I probably should, but you guys don't make it that easy. Pretty exclusive. And we don't really get along that well, but they're good people. They don't really seem like good people. You should stay away from them, Max. Stay away. If you don't, then what? You should be careful, Max. Tensions are rising. I don't think tonight's gonna go over very well. Who knows how bad the fallout will be. Max! Wake up! You and Willie are supposed to be out getting the alcohol for the party. Yeah, it's only, uh... 1.30? 1.30. I slept for 12 hours. Good thing. It's gonna be a long night. Eight months! It's been almost eight months since he died. Whoever did this was really smart about it. Obviously, it wasn't any of our friends. You guys, this isn't funny. I've been trying to solve this for eight months. My life has been nothing but this. And for what? Max was killed, and I can't prove it. There's got to be something we're missing. There's nothing we're missing. We know too much. Everyone has a reason for killing Max. Especially since they were all drunk out of their minds. And Beth was probably on drugs. So what do we do? Final start tomorrow, which means... People are about to go home for the summer. We won't see everyone again for three months, if even then. We're out of time. Hey, man. Damn it. I know you've enjoyed having me around all this time, but here's the thing. I'm not here for fun. I'm actually trying to help you, so I can help myself move on. Just leave me alone. I'm going to tell you what I've already told you about a billion times. You know what happened. What does that even mean? Chris, are you okay? You know what happened. Max, got the keys.
No. I saw who did it. I just can't remember. Take it back when it all began. Take your time, would you understand? But it's all about what it's all about. Something scratch and swear. Something you wanna forget about. No one expects you to
time to get the alcohol. Are you ready? Yeah. Thanks for keeping me in the running, sir. Uh, I talked to you last January, and uh, gave, you already had my proposal. Uh, I don't really know what we need to go over. Is this uh, kind of a question and answer type thing? Sort of. We normally have this all completed by March, but we've had kind of a situation to deal with. Uh, yeah, I heard about that. Someone cheated or something? Yes, someone did. Did you know Max Gossard? He nearly got the internship last September. He came to see me and turned in his work two weeks early. Very impressive. It was really something. And it was remarkably a lot like what you turned in. Funny, huh? Sir, I can explain. Good, because I've been looking forward to this. I want to know why I should even consider you. The four other candidates aren't as promising, but at least they turned in their own work. So explain. I... You can't, can you? You are no longer being considered for this internship, and please don't apply next year. Those ideas may not have been completely mine, and I understand that. But you gotta understand, me and Max were really good friends for a long time. And we had a lot of the same ideas. Did I steal the information? Yes. But you gotta realize that I helped to make it my own. Does Melanie know you're stopping by? Nope. Okay, is there a reason you're breaking into her room? Yep. Are you gonna tell me what it is? Nope. Are you gonna leave me alone? Nope. <gasps> yeah. I can't believe she's hidden this this whole time. I can. I'm just surprised I didn't find it until now. I'm in here all the time. Ever since I found it, I haven't been able to tell her, hey, get rid of your Mac Shrine or I'm dumping you. It doesn't exactly roll off the tongue. Well... Blake... What are you... How did you... I found it about a month ago. I was gonna go get rid of these. What I have is my business, Blake. You had no right to go through my stuff. Melanie, I'm your boyfriend. How do you think it feels to see you have something like this hidden away? It doesn't look good. Um, I think I should go. Yeah, I'm gonna go. What about you holding on to the watch Sarah gave you? I don't have that anymore. Well... You stole this? Why did you forget about Sarah? He didn't. Okay, Melanie, this is bigger than both of us still having feelings for our exes. I'm helping Chris figure out who murdered Max. And right now, this kind of stuff makes it look like it's you. And I may even have the answer to who did it. But I can't bring myself to look at it because I don't want it to be you. You think I murdered Max? I don't know what to think. You've been lying to me all this time. I can't trust you, Melanie. What are you saying? I'm saying that it's not working out. You're still in love with Max. Maybe it's because you're crazy and doing this, or maybe you killed him. I don't know. Whatever it is, this thing between you and me, it's not gonna work. You're breaking up with me? I guess. I like you, Melanie. I really do. But things are really not working out. I thought we could make them work, but it's not gonna happen. I should probably go. Blake, how did you do on the principal's final? No, you knew you probably failed it. Have fun taking the class again next semester. Third time's a charm. So, Chris, you ready to leave town? I guess you finished everything you were supposed to do. Nope, you forgot to solve my murder. Oh. Oopsies. I tried to. I did. But I can't stay here anymore. I have no friends. I've got no life. Me neither. Don't listen to him, Chris. You need to move on with your life. Just don't even worry about us. Sarah, what are you doing? You can't tell him that. Well, what happened to you and what happened to me is not his problem. Sarah, you're making yourself the angel over his shoulder and you're making me the devil. Not cool. 
Chris. I died. Someone murdered me. And they made it look like alcohol poisoning. It was one of our friends. And no one knows the truth. They're not my friends anymore. I can't even trust Blake and Vanessa, and apparently they're supposed to be helping me with this. Just go, okay? And don't come back next year. There's nothing waiting for you. I'm staying until the end of this week. If I don't find anything before then, I'm still leaving. Deal. You know you're closer than you think. What's up with you lately? You're just not the same. I don't know. Things just haven't been working out the way I thought they were. Oh, hey, Aaron! Adam! Over here! Hey! Hello, oh, Free Willy! What's hey. up, man? Hey, what's up? It's been a while. Yeah. What are you doing? I'm just uh, doing my booze thing. It's uh, Blake's birthday bash. You, know? you only turn 21 once. You guys gonna come? I don't think that we're invited. Yeah, I don't think you'd really want me there, man. Well, what does it matter? Because I want you there. <laughs> it's because it's his birthday, Willy. Oh my he god, Max! Yeah. Hi! Oh my gosh. How are you? Uh, you know I've been better. Yeah? Yeah. Wanna talk about it? Sure, you wanna walk? Yeah. You can't keep stringing Melanie along. I mean, especially if she doesn't feel the same way that you do. You have to tell her how you really feel. I know. I've been trying to, but she's just been so busy lately. And I've been spending more time with Sarah, and really to be honest, I'm starting to figure out what I've been missing out on. Don't give up. I mean, if you and Sarah are meant to be, it'll happen. And as for Blake and Melanie, that whole thing will work itself out. Yeah, well, in the meantime, uh, I've got to prepare for Blake's birthday party. So everyone's going. How are they? Uh, Blake's is his usual angry self. Uh, Tim's thinking about nothing but the internship. And Zach's kind of kind of just like keeping to himself. He's been locking himself in the attic. Really? <laughs> Why? It's rather complicated, I guess. Willie, he's his normal self. We just cleared out the liquor store. Yeah. <laughs> and, uh, yeah. Oh, I actually convinced Vanessa to come. Really? Yeah, I haven't seen her in like three months. Yeah, it's been longer for me. Is it true that she's become a bit of a, you know? <laughs> well, she doesn't uh, commit to just one man, if that's what you're saying. Nice. Oh, Beth. Uh, she's, she's been weird. Yeah, I know. What? What do you know? Nothing. I shouldn't talk about it. It's none of my business. Oh, come on. I've known you since, what, fourth grade? Yeah, you're gonna guilt me now? Yeah, <laughs> you can't start keeping secrets from me now. What's up? Look, she needs a lot of help, Max. She's been getting into some pretty serious stuff. What is she doing? Oh my god, Beth, are you okay? Willie, what are you doing here? Aaron called me. Why didn't you call? I only have one phone call. I'm not going to waste it on you. Okay. I know we've had our problems in the past, but I can help. My dad knows these really good lawyers. So I'm Willie, sure I, I already have a lawyer. A friend of my sister's. He just got out of law school two years ago, and he's supposed to be really good. <laughs> two years? Two years. That's the guy you're going to use? I can get you out of this. I can help. All right, I talked to the DA, and I think we can get this cleared, no problem. This is the guy you're using? This guy? Come on. Who's this? No one important. What did the DA say? Well, the charges of trafficking can be dropped, and you'll only be charged with one count of possession if you spend three months in the rehab facility. It'll be sealed and cleared off your record. Three months? It'd be over the summer. You'd be out before a fall semester. I'll do it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I can get you a guy who can get you off with nothing like that. I can go make- Willie, I don't need your help. Jack just got me a great deal. And besides, as a bonus, I don't have to see you for three months. Wait, Willie, you didn't do this, did you? You didn't tell the cops about me? No. Why would I do that? Well, someone did, and you did promise to do that if I ever dumped you. I didn't do it. I would never do that. But I'm going to find out who did. So that's the infamous Spree Willie. Don't judge me on that. I make mistakes, clearly. Hey. 
Zach, right? Yeah. What do you want? Oh, I just wanted to talk. Um, I was wondering if you'd heard, you know, your friend Vanessa happens to be a giant self-proclaimed slut. Hey, don't talk about her like that. <sighs> Weird kid. I've heard all these stories, you know, about you being really, really crazy. I just... See these? These pills? I'm clearly messed up and... <laughs> I've been taking these for a long time, and the ones I was supposed to get, I can't get anymore. Oh. So I can't stop. Wow. Them. Okay. <laughs> uh, I didn't mean to give you the impression that I cared, but um, I just wanted to make sure that everybody got the news about Vanessa's sexaholism. Vanessa so. is the only thing that kept me going. Oh, that's so sad. Because whether or not she's a slut, she's still out of your league. So I hope you're prepared for that and enjoy your loser life. Still nothing? No, I can't remember anything else. We already tried this once, and I didn't remember anything then. And why am I gonna remember anything now? I don't know, just try. Have you seen this? What is it? An invitation. An invitation to what? The coolest party of the year. Not exactly in the mood right now. Got that right. I can't believe this. What? He's insane. You have to go. You know you're not invited. Who's invited? It's just the eight of us invited. So a reunion of people who witnessed a murder? No. It's a celebration of all the year's accomplishments. What have we accomplished? Hey. Why are you doing this? Are you going? I think so. Why? We need to forget about the past and embrace the future. I think I'll be drinking. Me too. Willie, why? I'm gonna find out who reported you to the cops. We're gonna find out who murdered Max. How? I found the computer and tomorrow night we'll be able to confront who killed him. Fine, I'll go. We're coming. Willie, I'll be there. I'm in. Let's do it. Partay. Have you had this? It doesn't matter. But I found all the files and I made copies of them just in case. You haven't watched any of them yet? I watched a few of them, but I can't bring myself to watch the last one. Why? Well, I'm scared of what might be on it, and the last time it was watched was 252. That's the time my watch stopped working and the night Sarah disappeared. You think that means something? I don't know. You and I have both been seeing ghosts. I don't know what anything means anymore. Hey guys. Uh, you guys wanna come downstairs? Willie's doing a little toast. To what? To friendship and trust. That's really fitting, Willie. Okay, well, I'm gonna be pouring drinks. If you guys wanna be lamos and drink your soda pops, that's cool and everything, but I need to know who wants some. Yes, yes. Yeah, oh, yep. Yeah, Zach. Yeah. Just trying to have a good time. It's not like you care anyways, Vanessa. I'll have some too, Willie. Melanie. What? You don't think I have reason to drink? Melanie, maybe we should go upstairs and talk. No. Please. Willie, fill me up. <laughs> That's what she said. But seriously, it's four and four, right? See. Okay. So, well, I don't think this is going to go over there well. Oh. Oh. Easy there, Willie. Okay. All right, pass it down. Pass it down. Yeah, yeah. Pass it down. Oh, uh, I think we're all ready to toast. I think we should toast to Sarah and Max. What? I mean, they were both good friends. More so than all you hypocrites. And uh, they were people I actually liked. And Chris. Now they're both gone. Max is dead, and Sarah's supposed to be living it up in Houston. So I think we should maybe, you know, 
recognize the people that are no longer here. Okay, to Max and Saris, Air Max, S and M forever. Blake, I don't care anymore. Bad enough this crap. I don't know why I became friends with all those people. They don't like me, and I don't like them. It's because you're seeing them as suspects in a murder. Of course you're going to see their bad sides. I haven't seen much of their good sides lately either. You know, I like Max, but he's dead now. And none of them seem to care about that. And there's Sarah. But she mysteriously left town and didn't tell anyone. And nobody seems to care about that either. They've all got their own issues. You can't expect them to, to care about anyone else but themselves. I'm tired of it, Blake. Next semester, I'm not going to go here anymore. I'm transferring. You're leaving? Yeah, I have to. I don't belong here. I'm not part of the group. You guys are all trying to relive high school. You're miserable. I'm just not part of that. Sorry, it's all been building up for a while. So, uh, how about if we look at what's on the computer? Yeah, let me go find Vanessa. You're almost there, Chris. Honestly, I didn't. And I would never do that, but I'm gonna find out. Well, it's, I mean, still, I want to know. Vanessa. Yeah. I think I need your help. With what? You know, I have feelings for you. Yeah. <clears throat> you're, you're the only thing in my life right now that's good. I'm sure there's other good stuff in your life. Hey, Vanessa, can you come up to yeah. me? <laughs> I don't think it was Aaron. I mean, she would never do anything to harm anybody, so she was out of town too. Well, then it was Melanie or Vanessa or Zach even. I, they all know. I'm gonna figure it out. <sighs> Willie, why are you doing this? It doesn't matter. I'm still not gonna go out with you if you figure out who did it. I care about you. And yeah, I do want you back, but I also want to see you happy. And obviously someone got in the way of letting you be happy by telling on you. I'm gonna figure it out. I think I'm gonna start with Zach. He's pretty shady. Bad week? Yeah, you? More like bad year. I worked so hard to get that internship. Now I can't get it. Have they already made their decision? All I know is that they haven't told the person who got it yet. So why are you giving up? Well, because they told me I didn't get it. So, if you work so damn hard for this, why are you giving up so easily? I mean, you're smart, Tim. You know, Max used to say you were better at him than this whole business, at this whole business thing. Really? Yeah. That asshole dumped me the night he died, so what does he know? Yeah, even from beyond the grave, you found a way to ruin my internship. You know, I think we're both better off without him. You know, I think I have to agree with you. <laughs> Are you not gonna drink that? No. I know I'm gonna get that internship. Hey, how's it going? <laughs> so. Hypothetically, let's say you knew your friend was dealing drugs and you sort of called the cops on them. Would you, I don't know, hypothetically do that if you knew? I mean, hypothetically, yes, no? You guys ready for this? I've been waiting for this for eight months. Even if it doesn't show who the killer is, maybe it'll jog my memory. You guys can leave the door wide open like this the whole time. The killer downstairs or upstairs if it's Tim. She's alright, someone needs to go downstairs and make sure no one comes up here. How about you? And miss out on the grand reveal? Screw that. Someone has to. And you were the last one in the room. 
guess I can wait five minutes. I just want to know who it is. Be careful, guys. Guess this is it. Guess so. Hey, Zach. What's up? Same as always. So, um, I take it that, uh, now that you're in rehab, uh, this means our deal's off? Pretty much. You know, maybe you should just stop taking them. I mean, you couldn't possibly need them that bad, could you? You'd be surprised. Uh-oh, so you drinking? I think I'm gonna have to to get through this. What's going on, Vanessa? You seem to not be getting along with anyone lately. Yeah, I don't have as many friends as I used to. Like that. What? Chris, look out the window. Blake, what are you doing with Max's computer? You could just stop. Really, you could. You don't have to keep... I don't know what she told you, but she was a bitch to me. So you wanted to make her pay. This is none of your business. Anything with Beth is my business. Get out of here, Melanie! You stole this! No, someone took it from Sarah and put it in the closet downstairs. That doesn't mean it belongs to you! This shows who murdered Max. I'm gonna watch it. You might want to leave. You can't run from me, Zach. I'm a ghost. I can run from whatever the hell I want to run from. You can't run from your past, either. It's gonna eat you up inside if you don't face it head on. Don't tell me what to do. What are you doing here? Helping you with your memory problem. Where are you, Sarah? Are you dead? You know what happens to me. I just don't want to admit it. They never found her. Yes, they have. Hello? Police Department, I'm calling for Elizabeth Cleary. Yeah? I have some news for you regarding your former roommate, Sarah Thompson. What about her? So I took you back to your dorm room, and then? Went back to the house, because I forgot my keys. Play the file, Blake. You think I did it so badly? Play the damn file. Prove I killed him. But you could have ruined Beth's life. It's three months of rehab. I think she can handle it. But she shouldn't have to. Mr. Gunderson! Mr. Gunderson, hey! Tim, what are you doing here? Proving that I deserve this. This is a real presentation. That's all mine. Where are you going? Away from you. Away from all this. Then I went back to Max's room. And I saw... Max's killer. Here goes. Chris, were you just in Max's room? No, I was just looking for my keys. <laughs> Here they are. Good, because uh, I think he's asleep. Vanessa, do you know what happened to the last person who tried to get Beth in trouble? No. Where did everybody else go? I don't know, but there's something important I need to show you in my room. Okay. Oh my god. Where is he? Downstairs with Vanessa, I think. I'll call the police. Beth. Where's Willie? He's in the kitchen. But Chris, wait! Willie! Willie! I think someone's Willie. trying to get Willie. in. I think that can wait. 
What's going on? I just, I don't think you know how much I love Beth. No, I get it. You love her and that's all sweet and nice and everything. But she deserves everything she gets. No. No, she doesn't. I want to make sure something like this never happens again. Willie! So you watched it then? Yeah. Watched what? Max's video diary. Willie killed him. You mean he and... And Sarah. What about Sarah? Sarah's dead. Why are you doing this? Because I'm showing you that your actions have consequences. You can't just do what you feel like. Other people's lives are at stake. Yours is at stake. Hey, Willie. I, I thought everyone was sleeping. Everyone is. Music's off. First time all night. Yeah. The party's over, but the fun has just begun. Yeah. Well, you should probably get to bed. You're probably pretty drunk by now. No. I threw that up. Hearing your girlfriend is a drug dealer is pretty sobering. She told you? No. I heard you two. And do you not recall me telling you not to boss her around? Willie, I'm just trying to help her. Help? By putting her in jail? That's not helping, Max. That's ruining her life. Why would she deserve that? Willie, she needs to take responsibility for her own actions. No, Beth is living her life just fine. You need to stay out of it. Willie, go to bed. I'm gonna do what I think is right, okay? No, you're not. <sighs> Willie, this doesn't concern you. No, this doesn't concern you. Remember this? This bottle I got in Tijuana back in March? <laughs> Remember, it's pretty strong. I was the only one who could take it, and I only had a little that got me drunk, so if someone had a little too much, they might not ever wake up. You really don't. Do what? Really don't. Don't what? Protect her? She can't go to jail, Max. Ah. We can't be separated. You, on the other hand, I could probably part with. Willie, no. You're not, you're not protecting her. If you do this, don't. If I do this, what? She'll be living safely with me, and you'll be out of the picture? What? Sounds like a winning combination no. to me. Yeah, oh. another shot from the lover boy. And by the way, Max, me and you are going to be together forever. She's the love of my life. I can't live without her. You see, alcohol poisoning is pretty easy to set on. You just pour enough down someone's throat, and you don't give them time to throw it up. And they pass out pretty damn quick. You can't just kill people so Beth can do drugs. Oh, it's worked out pretty well so far, wouldn't you say? Blake is watching Max's computer right now. He's gonna see that you killed him. What? Willie, get out here. There's something I have to take care of first. Blake, help me break this door down. Hold on, I'll do it. Come here. William, open the door! Willie, stop this right now and open the door. It's Vanessa. She ratted you out. I can't let her get away with it. Willie? If you really love me, you'll stop this and open the door right now. I did it, Beth. I found out who told the cops on you. I did what you wanted me to. You killed Max. But it was to save us, to save you. You can't just kill your friend because he knows a secret of mine. Why did you do that? Because I love you. You have some twisted notion in your head where you think you have to protect me all the time, but you can't. I'm in the middle of something and I got arrested for it, but I have to serve my time on my own. And if you had just stayed out of my life from the very beginning, Max would still be alive. He was gonna ruin your life. He was trying to help me which is something you never did in the three years we were together. But I... I realize, Willie, that you love me, but I don't love you, and I don't care why you did it, but I could never be with someone who murdered his friend. You may have done it to keep us together, but you just ensured that we would never be together again. Beth! Beth! Willie, the cops are on their way. Beth! 
Willie, you killed the two people I cared about most. You have no remorse for it, do you? I did it. Do you made the last eight months of my life a living hell. But it's all over now. I'm moving on. Away from all you people. What are you doing? You know I'm screwed up, right? Zach, you're not screwed up. You're it's just... because of back in high school. I wanted to tell you, but I, I couldn't. I just... I, I couldn't. I wanted to tell you. Everything got screwed up. But you're taking your pills now. Those pills only control my mood. They don't erase the past, and that's what I need right now. Zach, what did you do? If you want my help, you have to tell me. I, I do, and I want to. I just don't think I'm ready. Not ready for what? 
I'll fix this. Everything will be fine if I fix this. I'll explain to you someday.